Hey guys, almost here. This is just an update video of what I've done this month really so far. Um, starting with the double lootations and dungeoneering XP weekend. I camped next for a little bit, a few hours. Um, I got bored of it, so I left. Um, it was a really good weekend though. I hope Jagex does a lot more things like it because I enjoyed it and I think most people did. Um, didn't get any loots so it's not like the most enjoyable next video because it is dry but it does show you double next drops and a few kills of them so you can sort of see the average next drops that aren't rare um yeah I achieved a few levels as well recently which are at the end of this video and you can see pardon me you see that I'm 97 Dungeoneering and at the end I might be getting a new skill cape, so that's quite good. Um, I was dun um, not Dungeoneering, sorry, I was doing necks with quite a large team, because it was all friends and stuff of World 77. Um, they stayed a lot longer than me, but I don't think they got any splits. Like because I was up until early hours and they're American and different continents and time zones so they could stay on longer and I had to go to bed at like 3 so I only got a few hours of naxing in but it was pretty fun it did cost quite a lot of money but it's worth it and the um, armadillo helmet you can see me wearing that I actually bought specifically for nax and it was very overpriced because I guess everybody else was buying them and I actually paid 10 mil coins just for the armor helm, which is a ridiculous amount of uh, GP just for an armor helm, to be honest. And also, I'd like to mention this is my first ever next trip with Rigger, which I'm quite proud of. There we go, that's just the uh, 10 million page, just to prove it. Um, yeah, and also I went charm collecting because I had the idea of basically doing familiarisation, I can't pronounce that very well, and then going to Water Fiends for time 6 drops because the minigame distraction to the version gives you time 3 and it was double lutations weekend in certain dungeons including the Chaos Tunnels. So I thought, I wonder if Jagex are letting us sort of stack up XP things because it didn't say that you couldn't. So... I PM'd Matt, actually no, I think I was on Skype with him at the time, I said, um, why don't you go and try doing this because I think it might work and you need the charms a lot. So he went and tested it and it did in fact work. So I mean, you can see it's really good charms. In 38 minutes I managed to get 606 charms and I think I finished with about 612 or something because I stayed for a couple more kills because it was still double um, drops. And then after that, I went Armadillo because I thought I'd try my luck at a double hilt, which didn't go quite as I planned because it was yet another dry trip. Um, I did actually have a dry weekend apart from I saw, I think it was a double tacit drop, but I didn't get it on video, so that's quite unfortunate. Um, yeah, I did sort of just a unicorn armadillo trip I wasn't really try hard in too much but also I did the vine which you can see towards the end I've got food but I haven't really got prey as much because the divine drained my prayer way too much and I wish that I'd taken my eagle eye kite or some more super preys even one would have made me last the right amount there we go that's the double god sword charge that's the only drop which I actually had solo or anything this weekend well last weekend or was it the one before? Uh, it was about nine days ago, so yeah, the weekend before the one just passed. Um, I'm rambling on a lot in this video because it, it is 7 minutes 47 seconds long, plus the intro. And I'm not the best commentator, I'm trying to get used to it. Sorry if my voice sounds a bit funny, it's quite early in the morning when I've made this and I'm still tired. But um, you can see the double drops, I mean, it's quite cool. hope that they do follow this up in a few weeks with perhaps another double drop weekend of different monsters because um, I, at the moment I'm questing quite hard towards tormented demons because I'd really like to experience those because I'm a high level PVMer 
I really do enjoy PVM and I can't even do all boss monsters which is kind of sad so I thought I'm going to go and get TDs and then eventually I'm going to go and get those glacial things but I'm not in a rush for those really yet I will get them but in my own time but I am rushing to TDs and hopefully they will bring out another double drop weekend or something maybe for them um, I think this is coming towards the end of my armor trip perhaps so I've got two doses and now one dose sorry if, that, if you can hear my phone um, so this is towards the end there we go I haven't got any more left by looks like I've just overloaded get a few more kills I haven't got much prey um, I end the trip with as much as is shown here I think it was about 1 mil or 1.2 mil it wasn't too bad to be honest um, it's hard to say if I profited without really thinking about it but yeah it's not a bad trip and this is just me buying my new Celtic longsword because I've never had one before and I heard they're really good for PVM and they have been out for a very long time now so I thought I'm going to go and get one and I believe it's the next clip that I show that is probably the biggest achievement of this weekend. Should we just wait for it? Yeah, come on. There we go. And I'm teleporting in with my friend. He's about to grab me on a new 99. And I'm not in fact getting one 99, I'm actually getting two. I'm getting 99 summoning and dungeoneer and off one effigy and a bit of farming XP thrown in there. Because I am in fact going for 99 farming if you didn't know. And there's one ninety nine, and here's the other ninety nine. Wait for it. Have I done it yet? Here we go. There we go. Two ninety nines, and now I'm gonna get the capes. But I'm really proud of getting ninety nine dungeoneer and something especially like together, because that's quite good. I've never really had a double ninety nine before. Um, I like both capes. They are pretty nice, to be honest, and. I will be just ramming them back in my bank soon, I'm not going to lie, because when I get that farming cape, that's what I'm going to wear. Um, it is coming towards the end of the video now, guys. Um, I'm going to try and release another sort of update video next month, perhaps around Christmas. And hopefully it'll be better quality than this one, because I'll get better at it. Um, It'll be showing my miscellaneous. Here's 98 farm, by the way. It'll be showing stuff like my miscellaneous loot and maybe some PVM drops the next one. Anyways, guys, that's just about it. Um, thanks for watching. If you've put up with me, goodbye.